Hello gamers and welcome back to another Hypixel Skyblock video. As you can see, I'm wearing actual armor and I'm in the Dungeons Hub, which means it's another Dungeons video. My last Dungeons video, which was also my first, was around four weeks ago and a decent amount of things have changed since then. First of all, I'm now Catacubes 21. Very cool, I know. I'm also one run away from Berserker 20, which is uh, also very cool. But the coolest thing is I hit 30,000 subscribers, which is also the requirement for YouTube rank on Hypixel. Probably gonna take a couple of weeks to get that, but yeah. I know this is very, very, very cliche, but from the bottom of my heart, thank you all so much. I really suck at making special videos, but I might make something if I get the rank. Anyways, to get things started on this video, I am gonna create a floor 5 party, because as I said, I am one run away from Berserker 20, and also, because I'm Catacombs 21 now, I can actually enter floor 6, but uh, I'm, I'm probably gonna die instantly. And I also got a lot of tips about what gear I should get, because I just had 200 million coins and I bought whatever I thought was good. Apparently this helmet was a decent purchase, but not the best thing that I could have went for, because a 5 starred golden head of whatever floor that I'm doing is best. So uh, if I'm gonna be doing floor 6, I should get one of those. Anyways, my party is full, I don't want to keep them waiting, so into the dungeon we go. Also learned a lot of secrets, like for example, I had no clue this was a thing, but now I do, so uh, I'm, I'm cool, I guess. But I still don't know all the secrets. Most of the time I have to look them up on the Dungeons Discord. Wait, someone just left the dungeon. Okay, two people left the dungeon. Anyways, since two people left the dungeon, for whatever reason, I'm just gonna look for the blood room so we can die in the boss fight. Is there a secret here, or am I just wasting my time? Ooh, there is. I actually have not tried this solo, so uh, yeah, this is gonna be interesting. Okay, why am I taking a lot of damage and I'm not healing? Okay, nope, 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 nope. No can do, sir. We're gonna attempt the boss fight, uh, the three of us. We actually- what? We got him! Bruh. We got an A. Kinda cringe. We could've gotten an S, but honestly I couldn't be bothered. That was pretty unlucky, but I still got Berserker 20, which is uh, what I was going for. Anyways, now that I have Berserker 20 and I'm Catacombs 21, I wanna attempt floor 6. I'm probably gonna die almost instantly, but I at least wanna try it. So let me just put my helmet back on and look for a party. I should have probably gotten a dungeon potion, but whatever, I'm only here to check the floor, so, uh, yeah. Oh, this is one of the rooms that I know every secret in, so uh, I'm gonna feel like I know what I'm doing. Wait, this guy died to an Enderman? Really? So far, it doesn't actually seem that different from floor 5. Even this guy's health is the same, I'm pretty sure. Okay, I've taken a lot of damage, what the? Okay, I take that back. This is a lot different than a floor five. Wait, what? What is this? This is a new mob for me. Level 110. 1.5 million HP. What is this thing? And I'm pretty sure this is a new room. Yeah, I've never seen this. Wait, no, I've seen those banners before. Yeah, I recognize this room. Never mind. Oh, oh God, there's another one of those. Wait, what? It died immediately? What? Okay, these things are not as scary as I thought. They're like basic mobs. I thought they were like mini bosses or something, but nope. Uh, wait, is there a secret here? Ooh, there is. Ooh, there's like three secrets in one room. What the? Ah, never mind, only two secrets. Okay, quick tutorial on how to use the Dungeons Discord. So this room is a two by one and it has four secrets. So if you just go into find room and then you type two by one, four, because it has four secrets and it's a two by one room. Oh, hey, I got the exact same room that I wanted. Who could have thought? But in case you don't get the same room you're looking for, you can use these arrows to look for a different room. But uh, yeah, this is the room I want and I can just find the secrets that I want. Wait, where in the boss fight? What, what, what am I supposed to do? I don't know. I never did this before. What? What? I, oh, excuse me? Um... Okay, uh, we just died. Wait, I got nearly 3,000 Berserker XP from this. 
even though we lost and this was a terrible run. That was almost the same amount as a clear in floor five. I think for floor six, I'm gonna need a five star golden head and uh, I'm kind of broke. I was only able to afford this gear thanks to Bumbley giving me 200 million coins, but because he's back playing the game and I don't really like taking contraband, I gave him back the remaining 100 million coins. And now I'm back to being at 13 million coins. I doubt that's enough to afford a golden sedan head. Actually, let me check real quick. I don't know the prices of these things. Wait, I can afford it? Really? Oh, this one has no enchants though. All right, this one has enchants, hot potato books, ancient reforge, five stars. Honestly, I might actually just go for this. Actually, forget about the helmet. I just spoke with someone who actually knows what they're doing and apparently this one right here is actually good. It's 4.3 million cheaper. Sure, it's not recombobulated, but I don't think that's necessary when it comes to these. It's five starred and that's the most important thing. It also has ancient and it's hot potato booked, so I am gonna buy it. All right, now that I have a much better helmet for floor six, I'm not gonna do floor six. I know, it makes a lot of sense. It's because I'm five livid kills away from getting a dark orb. Sure, it's not much, but this thing is over 400k and I need money because I'm planning to buy something else. So I'm just gonna run floor five, five times. That's a lot of fives. And if I get around 4,000 catacombs XP per run, I'm gonna get around 20k from five runs, which is gonna be pretty good. And because I'm not doing floor six, I shouldn't be using this. All right, time to find a party. Bruh. I didn't find any parties, so I made my own and and it's currently filled, so I'm gonna enter floor five. Oh, we have no dupes, that's great. That means each one of us is gonna get the absolute best for their class. I know there's a secret here. Wait, is this not a secret? Solvers are the best. Imagine actually learning the answers for these questions. That'd be so cringe. I'll take my free blessing, thank you very much. Wait, this room has no secrets. I didn't even know that was possible. Also, if you do the blaze puzzle, make sure you get this chest. It's right by the waterfall. All right, I just finished the first time and we got an S plus. Nothing worth it, yay. I'm gonna ace this trap room and I'm, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm just dead. Oh my God, I survived that 200 HP. Oh my god, I hate this trap room. Oh. oh my god, I really hate this room. Are you kidding me? Y you can do it. Yeah, I'm just cursed. I can't do it. Okay, I'm, I'm not gonna try trap rooms anymore. I just, I, I hate them. Second run wasn't as smooth, so we only got an S. Wait. Oh my god, no way I got this. This is what I was going to buy. I was gonna buy the epic one, but I mean, I'll take a rare one as well. Third run was another S plus because for some reason, a level 32 mage with Hyperion decided to join the party. Yeah. Oh, a dark orb for 250k. That is profit. And it sells for 490k. Actually like 500k, but whatever. Fourth run was also an S plus, this time without an overpowered mage. Was that last stand two? Two million. I'll probably take this because last stand one is profit, so it also makes sense for last stand two to be profit. I hope I don't regret this. I hope I don't regret this. And the final run is also an S plus. See, that's what I thought I got last time, but it was actually last stand, which is worthless compared to Legion. So I lost 1.6 million, but I don't want to talk about it. This used to be 1.1 million coins. It definitely went up in price. Now I can claim this. The other one didn't sell either, so I'm just gonna claim it back and sell them back at the updated price. Why do I have 180K? What? I don't even remember putting this on the auction house, but honestly, I'm not complaining. A dark orb already sold, so I'll take the money. I did floor five to make more money, but because I'm an idiot, I ended up wasting 1.6 million coins because I thought last stand was Legion. But luckily that won't happen again because soon Badline is getting the dungeon chest profit calculator, so I'm not gonna be an idiot anymore. Anyways, the main reason I wanted the money is so I can afford a treasure talisman. But luckily for me, I already got one just from doing the dungeon, which is how you get the talisman, if you couldn't tell. And someone bought the Legion book. 
2.8 million. I thought this was a lot more expensive, but I don't know if it's cheaper to buy it like this or to craft it myself. If I buy eight of these, which is how many I need to craft the epic one, I'm only gonna need seven actually because I already got one. It's gonna be around 1.9 million coins if I buy these seven right here, which is obviously a lot cheaper than if I were to buy this. So I'm just gonna buy seven of these. Now I can craft this. But because I only have six million coins, I can't really upgrade this to legendary. And I actually need nine epic ones to craft a single legendary one. All of that just to get an extra 2% extra loot at the end of dungeons. I'm also gonna need to reforge this to hurtful. Finally, that took a long time. And because this is a dungeon accessory, I'm gonna get 21 crit damage instead of 10. I'm gonna attempt floor six again, because I got a new helmet. And also this time, I'm not gonna forget to get the potion. Only 30k for regeneration force, 24 critical three, speed three, resistance four, archery three for 40 minutes. The last effect is kinda useless on me because I'm a berserker, but the rest of it, great stuff, I'll take it. Anyways, it's time to go die in floor six one more time. Alright, I'm ready. I'm gonna drink my potion this time. If I see a frozen adventure in floor 6, I'm just gonna run away because I don't want to die. It's a pretty hard fight even in floor 5 and I don't want to risk it in floor 6 because I know for a fact I'm gonna die almost immediately in floor 6. Wait, this is floor 5. I'm such an idiot. Oh my god. Oh, that was a complete waste of time. But hey, I got an S+. plus. Let's see if I can get something good. Ooh, Legion again. And two million coins. Okay, never mind. Okay. Let me click the proper floor this time. Good job, Brain. You did it. But it takes me back to floor five. It's not my fault. Okay. All right. Let me change my search settings to floor six. That's the proper way to do it. All right. Let's see if I can find a party that would accept my garbage stats. Uh, ooh, this one does. Hello there, fellow gamer. Would you like to die in floor six with me? Oh, we got an archer level 23. We might actually be able to do something. Oh my God. I, I, I forgot my potion. Oh my God. Well, I have dungeon potion five, at least in my ender chest. That's better than nothing. Bruh. Look on the bright side. I'm gonna get a dungeon potion. All right, let's try this again. This party would accept me and they have better stats. Drink my potion. Hopefully not die to a frozen adventure. I'm very smart. Okay, what is this room? I've never- uh, never mind, I've been here before. Oh, okay, okay, I take that back. I hate this, I'm out. There we go. I got the last secret. I- I totally knew it was there. It wasn't pure luck. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm pretty sure this is a secret and not just- Oh, yep, there it is. Okay, I can't one-shot those? Really? Shame on me. Kill the blaze in the- R Really? You know what? I don't care about S plus this run or even S. I just want to beat this floor, okay? I think I know a couple of secrets in this room, like this one right here. I'm pretty sure there is a shadow assassin above me. Uh, shadow assassin in floor six. Oh, it's not a shadow assassin. Okay, that makes life a lot easier. Actually, I take it back. These things are super tanky. Finally! Thank you. There is a chest over here. I think I missed a secret in one of these stairs. Was it right here? Yeah. Alright, I need one more secret, but I don't really remember what it is. Wait, I just realized something. I shouldn't be bothering with secrets because we're not gonna get S plus anyways. Oh, there we go. Instantly into the boss fight. Okay, uh... What, what do we do? Please explain. I'm clueless. Do we just vibe here? I think so. Are we supposed to kill golems then? Okay, people are dying left and right. I have no clue what is going on. Okay. Was that the first phase of the fight? Because I know this fight has three phases. Okay, I suck at this game. Hopefully I get revived by my healers soon. Fingers crossed. 
Unless they die in this phase, which is very likely. Oh, I'm being revived. Okay, what is this? Is this the actual boss fight? Okay, this guy can just make him fly and why is it targeting me? I didn't do anything. I'm innocent. Oh my god, we did it. We beat floor six. We only got B, but I don't I don't care about that right now. Yeah, basically nothing for these chests. That's to be expected. It's only B. And uh, th there we go. I beat floor six. I really wasn't expecting this to work out, to be honest, but... Yeah, I guess this helmet does make a huge difference. Anyways, now that I beat floor 6, I can start using fancier armor. I think it's called necromancer armor or something. I'm not sure. I beat floor 6 with a random party, just like I did with floor 5. Next is floor 7. I highly doubt I'd be able to do that with a random party though. Also, now that I beat the floor with a random party at least once, I don't mind getting carried in it, so I'm gonna make actual parties whenever I play floor 6. Once again, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for 30,000 subscribers. It's still mind-blowing to me that I reached it, honestly. And an extra thank you to my channel members. You guys are very pog. But yeah, as usual, Thank you so much for watching gamers, and I'll see you later. Peace.